Hi, I'm Steve Jones and I'm going to explain how to make an electromagnet from a piece of wire and a nail. Well, the nail has to be the right kind of nail. So you have to have a nail made of iron or steel. Copper nails won't do. You need copper wire, preferably. You can use aluminium, but it's not very common. Most wire is, is tinned copper and it is insulated on the outside with plastic. So that's what you need, a coil of that. And you need some kind of cell or battery. Just be careful, don't get too high a voltage, otherwise you'll probably melt your plastic insulation on your copper wire. The first thing to do, of course, is to take the steel nail, and it can be as big as you like or as small as you like, it doesn't matter too much. And around the nail, you wrap the copper wire. Now, starting at one end, you simply wrap it around the nail all the way down. Keep going always the same way round. It's got to be always the same way. And if you get to the end, it doesn't matter, just keep wrap, <laughs> wrapping it again, back round the nail, and keep going backwards and forwards until you've got a nice large number of turns on that wire. You want the bare ends here, that is, take the insulation off, and that is what you're going to attach to the cell. You simply put it straight across the cell, so it goes from there to there, and that is your electromagnet. If you want to switch it on, all you do is attach it. If you want to switch it off, you take one side off. That is a crude way of switching. You will find that this electromagnet, whilst it is an electromagnet, it actually, very often it becomes magnetic after a while, that this whole magnet thing starts to work and this becomes actually magnetic and the steel nail will retain magnetism. If that happens, uncoil it and then coil it round the opposite way and you can demagnetize it. To, so that you can start again with your electromagnet. So that's basically how to make an electromagnet out of a common garden nail and some copper wire and a battery.